Hello Aquarius, welcome to another love reading. This one's going to be all about what your person is currently thinking or feeling about you. What do you need to know about their intentions? As always, keep in mind that these readings are general, so they cannot and will not resonate for every Aquarius watching. So take what resonates for you, what applies to you, okay? Um, so we'll kind of dig into that today. Okay, Spirit for Aquarius. What are the main energies? This will be for those of you who already have someone in mind or are in some sort of connection. What are the energies in this connection between Aquarius and the person they are thinking about at this time? What is the main energy spirit in this connection? What do we need to know for Aquarius? Balancing act and who think was it Gemini might have been Gemini so we got balancing act in balance indecision juggling you're trying to restore balance in a situation so there's possibly a disconnect right now between you or someone something that feels out of balance bottom of the deck I have moving forward uh, cycles, endings, beginnings, you are moving forward into a new chapter. So, hmm, maybe this is something that is developing here. So let's get some insight. Let's ask the tarot here. All of the decks that I'm using are linked down below. Please remember that these um, readings will not resonate with everyone. So, Take what resonates, leave the rest. It might not resonate 100%, and that's okay. Okay, Spirit, what is this main energy here between Aquarius and this other person? What can you tell me about this main energy here? What do we need to know? Let's get some clarity here. What can you tell me about the main energy between Aquarius and this other person that they are thinking about or in a connection with? Indecision, juggling. Maybe someone doesn't know what to do. Oh, about a new beginning here. This is that new chapter that we were seeing in moving forward. Moving forward into a new chapter. It's like one of you wants to move forward into something new. And there's like an indecision about that. Maybe you both want to approach a new chapter in a different way. Tell me more about this main energy. For Aquarius Oop, look at this the world definitely this is all about a new chapter here so we'll clarify that further later on I just kind of want to set down the cards to get the message then we'll get some more clarity if we need it so let's look at your person's true feelings or intentions towards you this person that Aquarius is in a connection with. What are their true feelings or intentions towards Aquarius? What are their true feelings or intentions? Thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, subscribed, or commented on the videos. I appreciate all of the likes and subscribes. They help out the channel a lot. If you enjoy the readings, please consider liking the video. It helps my channel grow and it's free. All right, so let's get into this for Aquarius. What are their true intentions or feelings towards Aquarius? What are their true intentions? I'm using the Soul's Journey lesson cards for this. What are their true feelings or intentions towards Aquarius or this connection? Guilt. I release any beliefs that no longer assist in my soul's growth. So they feel guilty about something, either whatever's off balance, um, whatever has happened in the past between you. We'll dig into that a little bit here. Bottom of the deck, discipline. I accomplish, I can accomplish what I set my mind to. So maybe they're feeling guilty about something they haven't done. 
that they should have done. Let's get some insight there. Spirits, angels, guys, four Aquarius. What can you tell me about this guilt energy? How are they thinking or feeling towards Aquarius at this time? What can you tell me about this guilt energy here? What are they thinking or feeling? Page of Wands reversed, exactly. Something that has been taken off here. Either a message hasn't come in or... Either a message hasn't come in or they they started something but never finished it with the page of wands reversed. Maybe they lost motivation or made promises they couldn't keep. Okay, one more for how this person's thinking or feeling about Aquarius. What else can you tell us, Spirit? Are there true feelings or intentions? There's that two of swords reverse. This is about a decision that I feel someone hasn't made or they took a really long time in making a decision, whether it's a decision about what they want to do, how they want to move forward, how they feel. Can I get one more, please? Three of Swords. So they might have caused a lot of pain here. There might have been disappointment, heartbreak that I feel they're responsible for here. So let's see. Let me move this down here. What actions or energy will they bring to this connection with Aquarius? Using the Enchanted Map Oracle cards here. What actions or energy do they bring to this connection, Spirit? There's definitely potential here for a new beginning, a new chapter to start. Someone wants to restore the balance. So it's like someone wants to fix something that they feel guilty about here. What actions or energies are they bringing to this connection? For Aquarius. Rock bottom, my goodness. Number 10. 10s are numbers of completion, culmination. Let me read that real quick. I'm just going to skim. This is very similar to the 10 of swords. It seems you've reached a point where you can go no further in the same manner in which you've been doing things. The old way of doing things must be discarded fully in order to move onward and upward. Um, another card about moving forward. A new direction and a new strategy are called for. Mm -hmm. The rock bottom card is a sign that a miracle is about to occur, but only if you let go completely. Very interesting. So let's get some information about what actions they might take towards you here. So tell me more. What actions or energy are they bringing to this connection with Aquarius? What actions or energy are they bringing to this connection with Aquarius spirit? What actions or energies are they bringing? Seven of Swords reverse. What actions? What energies are they bringing to this connection? Three of Cups reverse. The second three that we get. Getting caught in a third party situation getting caught being deceptive maybe there's some sort of interference here that has um, led to some sort of ending what's at the bottom of the deck 
Six of Swords Reverse. Interesting. Maybe someone was supposed to leave a situation and didn't or was caught trying to leave a situation and then lied about it. Something like that. Can I get one more? I don't really see a lot of actions here. More like the energy they're bringing to this connection in terms of like how it's affecting this connection. Potential actions or energies that this person is bringing to this connection with Aquarius. Emperor, Aries energy here. And then bottom of the deck, the High Priestess. So I feel like there has been something here that hasn't been communicated or someone kept to themselves with the High Priestess. Um... You could be dealing with an Aries, does not have to be, but I feel like they got caught doing something. Um, they got caught either with another, inter you know, with, uh, and, and a Three of Cups reverse, this interference is anything that's interfering in your connection that someone's allowing to interfere in your connection. It does not have to be another person. It could be a family member. It could be fear. It could be lies, deception hiding their true feelings. Um, it could be not taking action, money, career, fill in the blank. I feel like whatever this, and again, I'm getting to this like idea of your person wants to take charge because the situation has hit rock bottom. The Their actions have led to an ending of some sort. That's what I see. So let's clarify these. I'm going to use a different deck. Let's get some more information. Help me clarify these energies. Aquarius, please. For the month of... Let's start with this Two of Swords Reverse because I'm curious. Spirit, what's this Two of Swords Reverse about for Aquarius? Two of Swords about for Aquarius. Three of Swords again in the same like spot here. The Two of Swords reverse can mean um, and look what's at the bottom. Ten of Swords reverse. This is rock bottom. This is like there's no more. There's nothing else that can, this has already taken place. There's nothing else that can really happen other than moving forward at this point with the Ten of Swords reverse. Maybe someone's willing to forgive and move on. Does not have to, but I feel like whatever happened here caused a lot of pain. Can I get one more for the Two of Swords reverse? And the, what I was going to say is the two, here's Justice, Balance, Libra, Energy. There could be legal matters involved for some of you. But what I was going to say with the Two of Swords reverse is that there's very different ways that you can interpret that reversal. So it could be that someone after some indecision has finally made a decision. Or it can be that someone absolutely refuses to make a decision. They're stuck in indecisive mode. You know, like I have no idea what to do and have closed themselves off. Um, I think that someone here has finally made a decision because they got justice, which is like the final decision, judgment being brought down. Um, it's also truth, objectivity, logic. Um, so I feel someone has made a decision here. Maybe the decision they made brought a lot of pain, guilt. And they're thinking about this, your person. When they think about you, when they think about this, this connection, they're thinking about how their decisions led to pain and possibly rock bottom here. Can I get some information here about the Three of Swords? Oh my God, my cards. Tell me about the Three. Oh my gosh. Tell me about the Three of Swords, please. Out here. My cards are like going crazy right now. About the Three of Swords. Down here. Yeah, look at this. Devil and Five of Pentacles. 
struggle, difficulty, um, distance, emotional distance. Uh, with the devil Capricorn energy, we have unhealthy attachments. We have obsession. We have addictions. We have temptations. Someone giving in to temptation. Someone putting themselves in a toxic situation. Whatever happened between you, it wasn't good. And it possibly led to a lot of conflict here. Tell me about the world. I know what the Ace of Wands is about, but tell me about this world. What can you tell me about the world for Aquarius? This is the main energies here. Wow, we got three. Holy smokes. Judgment reversed. Three of Wands reversed. And Four of Wands reversed. Which if Four of Wands reversed, that, that would be that imbalance. You know, there's no harmony, no balance in the home. Um, someone I feel wants out of this. What's at the bottom? Yeah, Page of Swords. What's behind that? Six of Swords. Interesting. So someone here I feel wants to talk about um, a new beginning. Um, and leave all of this, I feel, behind. Like this, they want to close this, a chapter on whatever bad judgment call was made, whatever imbalance there was, whatever harmony there was, whatever separation happened. Um, with the Three of Wands reversed, I feel like time. Um, either someone missed the boat on an opportunity by waiting too long, or someone has been waiting a really long time and they don't realize that the lack of success or the has or the um lack of movement is due to their indecision or their bad decisions with the three of wands reverse so definitely this is about a new beginning past you know now that we've hit rock bottom <laughs> i want to rebalance the situation i want to overcome these feelings of guilt i want to make the situation right with justice i screwed up bad <laughs> so what is this over here then what are, what is what is this with the energy they're bringing to this connection let me just make some room here for the cards tell me about the seven of swords reverse tell me about the seven of swords reverse eight of pentacles reversed I love the Seven of Swords reverse. Seven of Swords reverse is someone being seen for who they truly are. Page of Swords. Again, with the Page of Swords. I feel like there's... It's like someone was watching this person and caught them doing something they shouldn't have or they want to talk about what's been going on two of pentacles at the bottom reverse again with the imbalance someone cannot keep this up i feel like someone here they 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 weren't putting in enough effort into something or they were putting in crappy effort into something and so they're being seen clearly for who they truly are and maybe they want to talk about this, like why this has happened, why they, why, you know, what led to this. Can I get one more? That was sloppy. Can I get one more for this Seven of Swords Rivers? Ooh, Hierophant. Taurus energy. Commitment contracts. Maybe someone, uh, maybe you had conversations about commitment or um, marriage possibly. There's some sort of communication that took place here or that your person wants to wants to have 
Maybe they can't put an effort into a commitment. Maybe they want to um, talk about what you caught them doing or what you've realized about them. I'm hoping that they weren't keeping a commitment like that's not part of the deception. I'm really hoping that's not the case. Tell me about this Three of Cups reverse. Why is the Three of Cups reverse? Let me move this up. Why is the Three of Cups reverse for Aquarius? Ace of Cups. New love, emotional, like overflow. Oh, okay. And then we got the Empress reverse. I feel like whatever interference is happening here, it's not, the problem is not love. The problem is that either there's an empress reversed here, or something's not growing or manifesting. Bottom of the deck, I have the wheel of fortune. So it could be that it's just not the right time, or maybe things are turning around here. Um, behind that, I have the 10 of wands reversed, letting go of something, of a burden here. Fate could be involved in whatever this love is. Maybe your person know, it's like, it's like they know that, um, they know how they feel about you. They know that they love you. That's very clear here, but I don't think that's the problem. I think the problem is whatever third party interference is here, whatever's causing an imbalance, whatever someone was caught doing, whatever guilt someone has over an action or an action they didn't take. So tell me about this emperor down here. Tell me about this emperor. Aries energy here. Tell me about this emperor, please. Knight of Pentacles reverse, Four of Swords reverse. Knight of Pentacles reverse, a very slow offer. Um, he is delayed. He has a lot of obstacles he has to go through. For me as a reader, the Knight of Pentacles reverse still makes it to his destination, but he has a lot of hurdles along the way. And it feels like his progress is like, not like there is no progress, it feels like. Four of Swords Reverse, this is someone who is restless, ready to get up, take action after doing some serious reflection. They've been doing a lot of healing, a lot of thinking, and now they're ready to get up and move. Bottom of the deck, Six of Swords. For some of you, here Aquarius your person has to leave a situation they have to get up and move away from a very unhealthy unstable environment to something more stable more solid calm tell me more about this Emperor Queen of Swords reverse Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, energy. Queen of Swords, reverse. Very difficult person to deal with. Very cold. Not a good communicator. Tell me more about this Emperor. Seven of Wands, reverse. So I feel like there's, this Emperor is They no longer want to resist or fight this. Or perhaps they want, they're wondering if this Queen of Swords Reverse will even, you know, like it's almost like this Queen of Swords Reverse is not going to be interested in anything this Emperor is bringing. So this Emperor is thinking about how do I make it so that they're not resisting me, that they're not fighting this, that they're not giving up on this. 
You know, what do I need to do or say so that the Queen of Swords is receptive? Very interesting. So I feel like communication 